When 3M developed its high-performance SECR transmission conductor, we knew its all-aluminum-based material gave it some unique properties. The core is comprised of alumina fibers in a high-purity aluminum matrix. The composite core reduces the conductor sag at high current levels. It is also lightweight and high strength, making it an effective way to increase the capacity of transmission line by as much as two times without having to modify structures or rebuild the line. Another advantage the conductor has, because it is all aluminum based, is that it is less susceptible to galvanic corrosion between dissimilar constituents. In standard steel and aluminum or carbon fiber and aluminum conductors, you need to have a special coating or barrier known as a galvanic coating between the core and the other layers to protect against galvanic corrosion. About 11 years ago, we decided we wanted to test the corrosion resistance of 3M ACCR in actual field conditions. We chose Oahu, Hawaii as the location because the trade winds are heavy with salt water, making salt spray and galvanic corrosion a major problem there. In fact, it is one of the most naturally corrosive environments on Earth. The electric utility does not commonly use steel core conductors because they don't last very long. We also have environments such as marine environment, like here in Kahuku, um, volcanic environments that produce acid rain, agricultural environments where we may have contamination from fertilizers. In all of these um, climates and environments are located in a relatively small region, making atmospheric corrosion studies um, very practical. We worked with the Hawaiian Electric Company, or HECO, on the University of Hawaii on this project. The project had two phases. First, samples of 3M ACCR and ACSS were installed in test tracks at HECO. The samples were monitored over a period of three years, Although the SCSS sample clearly showed corrosion forming, the SCCR showed very little corrosion. But we wanted to know how the conductor would perform in actual operating conditions, not just in lab or simulated environments. The sample did not sufficiently demonstrate the performance of the conductor in actual field conditions, since no electricity flows through the sample. So 477T16-3M ACCR Hawk was also installed on one of HECO's 46 kV distribution lines. The installation remained in place until June of 2013, or about 11 years, in an environment that corrodes steel core conductors in as little as three years. We took the conductor down to test how it had held up. The first thing we did was to visually inspect the ACCR, the results did not show any signs of corrosion or pitting in the outside aluminum wires or in the core wires. Next, we shipped the conductor back to St. Paul to test the strength. We tested two samples of conductors using a cable strength tester. The rated breaking strength of ACCR Hawk is 19,200 pounds. The strength of the conductor that had been installed and operated in this heavy salt water environment ranged from 105% to 106% of the RBS. Then we tested two conductors with dead ends and their strength tested from 107% to 108% RBS. We also measured the conductor weight and the results showed no measurable changes. The conductor was disassembled and inspected under optical and scanning electron microscopes for sign of corrosion and pitting. Apart from a slight discoloration and darkening of the outside layers, there were no signs of corrosion or pitting. The results of this long-term field test clearly indicates that 3M ECCR high-capacity conductor has excellent resistance to salt pre-corrosion in extreme but real field conditions. 